from the depths against Belgium. Here's the chance for Eric Lepke. Oh, it's there! They've done it! It was the biggest serve of Eric Lepke's life, as that match point secured a spot in the 2024 Paris Olympics next summer for Team Canada. The team was victorious over Mexico in its final game of the men's Olympic qualification tournament in China, and the Manitoban outside hitter led the charge, scoring 16 points in the final match. It's surreal, man. It's, uh... I still can't believe it. I, uh, kind of have to pinch myself. Every uh, every day I wake up I'm like, man, I'm going to be an Olympian. I'm going to Paris next year. Growing up, Lepke says it was always his dream to play on the national team and go to the Olympics, a dream that is coming to fruition. As a kid, that's always like the kind of pinnacle of every sport. Um, as I learned more about the game and like actually learning that I could make volleyball a career, I was like, oh, there's some cool things you can do with pro, like Champions League and all that stuff. But I think Olympics has always been kind of the, the NLBL for national team. It wasn't an easy road to get where he is now. In 2021, Lepke was one of two Canadian players released when national teams were required to cut down their rosters from 14 to 12 players for the Olympic tournament. From the previous Olympics not making the squad to this time being an integral part of being, you know, qualifying for Paris, incredible, absolutely incredible. Michael Stevens was Eric's club coach from 2013 to 2016. He says Eric is a generational player that doesn't come around often. He always knew Eric was going to be special and was special based on his physicality and what he could do. How far he could go really wasn't sure. Um, like I said, that humility, the constant uh, learner that he wants, that life learner, has made him to who he is. Stefan Lavallee played volleyball with Eric for several years and always knew he would go far. He was always a dominant player, even from, from a young age. Um, he always had the potential, and I think his work ethic um, has showed kind of where he's able to get. Lepke's career really took off when he played volleyball at Steinbeck Regional Secondary School, where he led the team to its first provincial quadruple-A volleyball championship in 2014. I think it's inspirational to, to players in this community that are working towards potentially doing, you know, something similar. As for Lepke, he says the message is simple. Don't give up when things don't go your way. Let's go chase your dreams. Um, I took a lot of leaps in my career just going for things and, and trying new stuff. So I think don't be afraid to fail. You have to put yourself out there. In Winnipeg, Alex Scarpa, City News.